Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use the Run Tools add-on, which is all-in-one add-on and grid, which is bundled with a tool for every need, creation, detailing, presentation, or rendering, with a non-paralleled grid-based Boolean and the draw system, a single-click solution to Boolean cleanup, modify presets, tools to add wires and simulate them with one click, and backup tools to help you manage object backup versions like a pro walking will never be this easier and efficient new hdri library and advanced board shader fast cutter mode for p cutter set browser support for material library improved cloth and cable simulations boolean cleanup stride forward palette solution for clean boolean cuts no more sliding and merging hassles precise control via easy to use sliders also we have a different uh, bunch of uh, great features cable tools great cables and generate multiple wires and so on but rendering also we have uh, so we have the backdrops backdrops uh, to set up uh, lighting and using batch rendering tools creating rendering presets and render with different angles cameras and settings one click backdrops and light setups material tools also material dropper as you can see and we have also texture baking tools light groups and so on you can check it i have a link in the description if you want to buy it uh, it's add-on worth buying let's let's get started with installation of this add-on go over edit then preferences then install then navigate where you you have the uh, I've had the file to install it also. I have installed, I don't need to repeat the to reinstall it again. Also, we click on this, uh, click on this triangle in order to expand and to see the information about uh, this add on as shown here. We have a key maps in order to, uh, to see what are the main shortcuts to run it around different features and to customize. Also manage panels as shown here back manager random tools back tools light tools also the asset folder also you can change and uh, control the on screen user interface text color text also sub text color and much more for background uh, also uh, Michel Lanius also close path project directory if you want try it yourself Let's get started with our add-on. Click on N to show it on this side panel as shown here. It's over here. Click on Run Tools. In order to see to have uh, the backup camera tools, also the curve tools, random tools, material tools, light tools, and bake tools. So the P cutter. First of all, uh, let's launch the Pi menu. We have the three Pi menus. You use uh, three shortcuts to launch them. First of all, Shift W is going to be launching this Pi menu as shown here. Escape. The second Pi menu is Shift -E to launch this uh, Pi menu. And we have another Pi menu which is Shift Q to launch it as shown here. First of all, let's launch the, the, pi, the main Pi menu. Shift W as shown here. Shift Q. Then draw to just uh, draw using the mouse cursor as shown here. To make uh, booleans like this, drag the mouse cursor to the right. Click to confirm. And you have uh, cut to draw this uh, mesh as shown here. Shift Q again. So let's draw like this. And we have uh, this menu as shown here. If you want to make a circle, make a mesh, boolean, and uh, you cut draw this uh, mesh using circle. 
or polygon, for example, X. Like this, and you can cut through this uh, mesh as shown here using polygon shape. Shift Q again, draw, and you have a bunch of different features if you want to change them. Um, uh, this, uh, all this, these shortcuts are for different, uh, this bunch of features for the Boolean mode as shown here. You can hit D to switch to boolean mode. Align to edges as shown here. Also agree to edge wireframe if you want. So let's continue our tutorial. Also shift Q to show the main menu then hit D key. So it's gonna be showing this menu for the boolean mode, just for boolean mode. You can hit D to bring it. Also we have different meshes if you want to cut through this object, this mesh, using them like circle, polygon, strip mesh. Also let's try C, hit C. And you can draw draw like this click on left mouse button drag and uh, don't release don't uh, confirm so just uh, just make it like this and uh, the, i'm gonna be showing you some features on uh, this uh, using these shortcuts for the boolean uh, boolean operation which if you want to change mode for example shown here hit u is gonna be making the boolean as union also, D is going to be creating difference in between these two objects using the boolean operation. If you want to intersect, hit I. The I key is going to be creating intersect. Also, for the C to insert, as shown here, for the slice, hit S in order to slice draw this mesh. And insert amount, hit A to insert amount, as shown here. This, this is going to be crazy and degrees. Also for M to solidify. We have also the array. If you want to change the mode to array X, Y, Z. For example, array along the, the Y axis as shown here. It's going to be creating array along the Y axis. And if you want uh, along the Z axis, hit Z, so it's going to be creating a array along the Z axis. And along the Y axis, also array along the Y axis. To confirm array, click on the left mouse button, it's going to be confirming. See you in next tutorial because this all-in-one add-on is, uh, uh, is a great add-on need to be uh, explained in uh, three or four videos so see you next tutorial thanks for watching